a mudslide in the Avila fire burn scar caused some really scary moments for some Shell Beach residents overnight. Now they're wondering if the worst is still to come. News Channel reporter Dave Alley joins us live in Shell Beach with reaction. Dave? Now, Beth, we were live on location uh, back in June, almost from this very spot when we saw the hills right here above these homes on fire. Now, ever since then, there's been a lot of concern what would happen during a major rainstorm. And last night, we found out all the mud and debris you see behind me uh, showing what happened. And now what happens next is causing a lot of concern in this neighborhood. I looked out the window and I saw the, the mud flow. There definitely was a mud flow coming down the street. Phyllis Snelling describes terrifying moments in Shell Beach late Thursday night that triggered her worst fears. I would be entombed in mud. I mean, I don't want to make a light of it, but you don't know. There are all kinds of hypotheticals. After absorbing heavy rains for two days, some of the hillside charred in last summer's Avila fire gave way. The pictures in my home are crooked from this. It hit hard enough that it that it rattled the neighborhood. That's now littered with mud, rocks, sticks, and other debris. The mailboxes are just covered. The street is covered. The fire hydrant is uh, half buried. So much mud slid down off of the hillside that it is now covering a huge section of the street here, probably at least 100 yards or so. And in some places, it's several inches deep. If you look at the hillside, you can see spots that are, oh, five, 10 feet wide that or several inches deep where the soil came down. While damage is minimal this time, there's growing concern about the future. If the hillside slipped, uh, uh, it, it was going to start moving houses. Uh, if we got anything like uh, Montecito. If we get some heavy, uh, heavy rains, uh, I, I'm going to start to worry. In the meantime, there's hope conditions will improve and mitigation efforts will be made. We're worried about our safety. We're worried about our uh, our home, something needs to be done to take care of this, to protect us. Now this neighborhood and the hillside, uh, they're both privately owned. The city and the county has no role in the maintenance. Uh, many of the residents tell me today that they're battling with the homeowners association to try and have some of the preventative measures that we see on the hillside just down the road taking in these hills. It says uh, they've been saying that they've been battling with that HOA for a long time and it's sure to heat up uh, even more after this. Reporting live in Shell Beach, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley. Better. All right, pretty worrisome. All right, thank you, Dave.